So let's look at some attack alternatives we've already All right, so let's say I have the arm on this side. All right, if he keeps it dangling like this, I catch it with my armpit, hug your leg, elbow tight, eyes on the This one can be hard to get sometimes. So if it's on the sides, catch it with my armpit, pull it down, just lock my hand in my body. If you can fit this foot in the hip, that's even better. I can use that to bridge up with. If he turns his arm to hide it, I go for the squeeze. If he exposes it like he just did, put it back on my knee, I just catch it right here. So this is the game I'm playing. As I go for this and he turns it, I go here. If that's look, if that's here without the other hand covering it, just get your wrist inside of it. He's here. So here go. Just use my wrist. Sometimes you end up with a hand. Sometimes you end up here. I just hug it. Palm up. It's one of the few arm locks that I like. Palm up. It's when it's across. Okay. If it's on the other side, I'm gonna go palm. Up. <coughs> I'm not even gonna fool with attacking that arm. This is a better move. I like the reverse shoulder break from here, which is this. If I can catch that armpit, I can lock him out. A lot of times the guy will want to push your foot down and he'll step up for power to do that. If I can escape this hand and hook that leg, it's even worse for him. So and this, nothing is etched in stone. I'm just I'm chasing the guy. So he hides the arm to the other side. Right away, I push his head and I go on plot and if I can fish this in, that's my go-to finish. Because it's quicker than coming around here, setting up, breaking the guy down. So again, I got the triangle, but before I can secure the arm, he hides it on the other side. Right away, look, right here. You swivel this inside, find that armpit, hands on the floor, and I scoot back as I straighten my legs. So I jump the triangle, but before I can secure the arm, he goes here right away, look. Push his head away, pull us around, swing that inside. Partner up. The best way to get under the armpit is to start off with the correct double plot. My thigh against his ribs. If you're the guy that swings way out here by the elbow, your leg's gonna come up short on the other side. Okay, so it all starts with a good arm plot. I'm here. When he hides that arm, I stay next to his body so my leg is as long as it can possibly be. And right away, I use this leg to pull him down. See, it's not just, if I only straighten this and this leg doesn't move, I gotta max out. If I pull my knee down, look what it's doing to his shoulder. So I'm pulling the knee down and stretching, which lifts his head up. So the shoulder's going down, the head's coming up. Meanwhile, I gotta keep a strong flare, like an uh, ankle lock defense. You put the boot on, toes up. Can't leave my toes loose, he swims off. Now he pushes my foot down. I got nothing, now it's a scramble again. I don't know what's gonna happen here. If I get here, I know what's gonna happen. What's that? All right, so again, let's go back to the details here. As soon as he swims around, this leg drags up. I don't lift it way back here, it just loose six inches of space it's here to here to here boom got it if you get here something's off you can't tap the guy swim underneath this arm and lift it okay you don't know what's going wrong but he can't get to your hand but something mechanically is not right on my push i swim underneath i hook i can either hook my leg or his elbow and I just finished doing what I wasn't able to do with my hips. Excuse me, grab his hand. If you got his hand right there, pull his hand for you. I would go ahead and grab my foot. Oh, you mean for the finish? Well, just so he can't, yeah. Uh, I could. Okay. I could. Let's say he gets my foot, starts so pushing my foot off. He's only got so much time. He's on borrowed time there. All right, so let's work that one. Come underneath. You got to get a feel for how to swim under and how to crank it up. I prefer to grab his elbow as I swim under. So I'm here, I get here. Let's, let's assume I get everything right, but I'm not sure why he's not tapping here. 
rather than exert myself, which he will eventually escape, I'm going to swim underneath right now and hold his arm here. And it's not like a straight arm lock. It's an arm lock. Swing this up. You roll with Jack, you already know what that feels like. <laughs> <laughs> All right, partner up. 